Hello there, everyone. How's it going? Welcome, welcome. Hope you're having a great day over there. And welcome back to another Salmon Run stream. How is everyone's day? Hey there. The challenge is going on right now. You should play it. Is it the random weapon challenge? Um, we will probably just play Salmon Run today, honestly. Um, we'll keep to it. But I hear it's actually quite a lot of fun. <clears throat> hey there, Slagger Knot. All right, without further ado, let's warm up, shall we? How does everyone like the, the rotation today? It's almost weekend. Are you excited for that? Uh, I can't wait for weekend personally, but it's it's getting so hot that it's summer madness. It is summer madness over here already. And I know a lot of people are having exams, so good luck to a lot of you as well with all those exams. Also later today, well not later, in one or two games, if any members wants to join, then that's also, uh, we're also going to be having member lobbies. So if anyone wants to join, feel free to. Let's do a warm-up game quickly while we're talking, shall we? <clears throat> it's a decent rotation. It's not amazing because I think like a lot of the weapons are technical, but you know, it's Sakai Station with range, so can't really be bad. <clears throat> hey there, Anna. How's it going? Yeah, like a lot of people will struggle with <sighs> with the free uh, with the hydra spell thing. Honestly, like I should probably make a, a mobility video. I was thinking maybe tomorrow I will like a video on <clears throat> on how you should be moving with these weapons if you're in trouble. Yeah, I think the technical weapons are more fun, too. But yeah, like, a lot of people don't play the Hydra Split Lang uh, smooth enough, so to say. Yeah, I do have a guide on Marooner's Bay. I have a lot of guides for Marooner's Bay. It's funny because, like, I even have all these playlists and everything, like, really well organized, but... I noticed that a lot of people don't really care about checking general map guides. Like, a lot of people are mostly interested in the, you know, exciting things. So I think like, most people think... Griller and Night Wave in general map guides are boring. I, I don't know if that's the case. That's how it feels like. Steel Eel! Damn. Splat Doolies are so good. Hey there, Chase. How are you doing? Boing. Honestly, I might have to revisit the, the ratings on... Ouch. I might have to revisit the ratings on the Splat Doolies. Not that I think they are completely wrong, but probably... It's better than... I mean, I know it's a good weapon, but... Maybe it deserves more green slots than it got. Overall. Woo! Don't let them go. Boom. Nice. GG! Oh, right! Wait! Right, 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 right! There's also... No, it's the 24th. Salmon... Uh, salmon Run 2. <laughs> Splatoon 2 is getting a, 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 a golden rotation, right? Yeah, on the 24th. Yes, anyone is allowed to join the stream, honestly. Even if you're low level, I, I don't mind. Okay, the the stinger is priority. Woo. Mm. 
Well, that was a decent snatcher, I would say, but... So yeah, one of the rules, you don't need to fully charge your Hydra every single time that you're shooting. Only charge as much as you need. And like you're gonna be able to respond to danger much better. Because I think one of the problems with the Hydra is that, that like, people can't respond to danger fast. And that's what I mean in the reports to, you know, learn how much you would have to partial charge. Learn those thresholds that you need to know. Sweet. I actually do have a video about that too, but again, like, I will probably make a mobility video for weapons like the Hydro or, or Blasters. We'll see. Helping with those Quahawks. That's a nice one. So I shouldn't stay here. It doesn't matter that the cannon is there. I'm going to support them from here. But yeah, again, it doesn't matter how good it looks. The Jet Squelcher should not be on the shore. Like, it's a ticking time bomb. No matter what. Like, that's one way to prevent unnecessary splats on you. Just know basically situations that you should avoid. Instead, help the others get into that situation, right? That's so many eggs. Okay, maybe... With a wave breaker, I might be able to do this. There we go. Yeah, with a wave breaker, maybe I'm I'm brave enough to go to the shore. Sweet, GG. That was a good warm-up. This rotation is really good. I like it. Smooth and easy. Alright. Let's do the member games, shall we? I think that one warm-up game was enough for me. <laughs> Let's play. D D D. Alright. Let me make the lobby. For members, uh, either on Discord or on the on the community posts, now you can see you can see the password if you wanna join. Grizzlers, <laughs> not Drizzlers, Grizzlers. I like that. I like it. So until people join. So what you wanna do with the Hydra? If, like, you know, you're an enemy ink, is this. Like, again, it's the same as blaster hopping. And you can escape from any situation. It doesn't matter. You will never be cornered with a Hydra like this.
Yeah, like, I would just call it hopping, but most people have no idea what hopping is. So, like, I... Especially in the reports, I have to call it jump shooting. So, like, people actually have an idea what it is. Let's do this. Well, even under a fish stick, I think you can get out. Like, this will let you get out from a fish stick. <clears throat> well, I do hope that people do cancel their charges if <laughs> they don't need all of it. Like, <laughs> don't waste it. Ah, no time. How about we can paint a little bit? Nice. No, I wanted to get it. <laughs> Right, uh, let's get the eggs. Moz? Um, did we get the the steelhead? Yes. Man, the, the Hydra is such a fun weapon to play. I'm curious, in general, do you all like to play the Hydra or you're not a fan? It's just such a fun weapon, really. Like, it's technical enough, but at the same time so overpowered that it's... It's fun. There we go. I really need to buy another monitor, like, so I can reach chat easier, because... Right now, everything is in the way. Hydra is one of your favorites? Nice. Mixed. In tower control? Oh, okay, that, that's a different topic. That's different. We get it? Yes. Okay, Moz. Are we getting it? Okay, we got the fly fish. Oh, that's a nice... Okay, I was about to use my killer veil, just to be sure, but that was a nice inkjet. Now we have the quota. Well, let's collect more. GG! This comp is really good because it makes up for the Hydra slow movement with paint. It is actually this comp has terrible paint. Uh, it's interesting you say that because 
Actually, the paint is quite terrible. Whoa, 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 whoa. There was a target change. So it's actually awesome though we are trying the, the basket strat. I'm happy about that. I was even surprised. Filtering. Not be oh that one chum from behind. That one chum. <laughs> ah, get me. Nice. Okay, let me get up here uh, and collect eggs. I think we should have enough eggs on, on the ground. Oops. Oh, nice. That's a really nice booyah. Ah! Yeah, by the way, while you're wall clinging, you can throw a bomb and still stay safe. So like that way you're not completely useless. So be here, throw a bomb, and come back. This way you're not useless. Alright. Shino, thank you so very much and welcome on in. Welcome on in. Thank you for the membership. Awesome. You've been using the dually dodge wrong? What do you mean? Um, please elaborate so maybe maybe we can also help someone else doing the same mistake. <clears throat> also, if there are more members who want to play, then, uh, you know, we're gonna swap every two to three games or something. So more people can come in. You stand still. Oh, oh, you have to. Okay, so. Okay, this is why I call it turret mode, okay? Uh, I didn't get it. So, the way dualies work is after you dodge, you deal more damage. Like, not a little bit more, a lot more. And usually you shoot faster too. Now, if you move, then it, you're not gonna, you know, deal more damage. You cancel the so called turret mode. So if you never play the dually, this is extremely important. Like, if you're not doing the turret mode, let's say with the dapple duallys, it's an average pretty bad shooter. If you use the turret mode, it's the second best weapon in the game. Okay, for me it's third, for most people second, but still, like, I will show it when I get the... The splat duallys again, but, uh, but yeah, that's, that's like very important. Uh, okay, I'm gonna help here. Ah, oh, well, we still got it, so perfect. You see, like, normally you could miss the shot. Don't fully charge your Hydra every time. You're gonna run out of time. And yeah, we need to collect eggs, everyone. Nice. Yay. Not every dually has that, but Frankly, 95% of them do, so keep that in mind. All right, so I can show. In case you're new and you don't know. So dualies shoot like this normally. 
But if you roll, you will see you're gonna, like, kneel. You see, I have a special stance. Now I'm shooting faster, I deal more damage, and some of them even have better range. But if you move, you cancel it. It's very important to to use. You see, this is why feedback is so good, because I didn't even assume... And there's no problem, by the way, so I'm not, I'm not criticizing you, of course. But I didn't even assume that someone doesn't know this. Um, so I might make more basic videos as well for these things, because I guess, like, there's a lot of new players who... Who missed the basics. For example, another cool thing you can do with a dually is when you're falling, you can make your falling faster. You see, like, you can roll in the air and you're gonna land on the ground sooner. It's also really good for dodging stingers. You see how much faster I landed? <clears throat> After jumping here. So you can speed th speed up a lot of actions this way. I'm sure you did better than you think, Omori. But even if not, don't worry. It's not the end of the world. <laughs> there is the mo Is it after me? It is after me. Careful! Need to get that Drizzler. We have more than enough eggs, so I just straight up splat the Drizzler. <clears throat> nice eggs incoming. Well, I did not need my second inkjet in the end. GG. When you throw bombs at a fly fish, what side do you tend to aim at first? It doesn't matter. It, that's urban legend, okay? It's like, th this is why <laughs> I, that's one of the funniest things about Splatoon. There are so many of these fake tips that people spread, that just, like, it's not true. It doesn't do anything. So it doesn't matter which basket. Just throw a bomb, okay? Don't, don't waste time choosing which basket you should aim at. Bomb a, bomb a fly fish basket. That's it. Mm, all right, let's do one more, and then we're gonna let others in too. Yeah, the servers have been kind of unstable, I agree. Lots of disconnects. Yes, we're gonna play this one more game and then we're gonna rotate the members.
again, like, the, the whole thing is not... It's unimportant. Like, whether it's a... That the left one is the, the farther side and the right one is the closer. Once you once you split a basket, the remaining one basket is going to do the same thing, no matter what. That's why it doesn't matter. Like, it, it doesn't matter which basket does what. Once you split one of them, they're gonna be... The, the, the remaining one will be the same anyway. We have bad snatchers for the shore, unfortunately. Are you gonna do that? Okay, then I'm getting the Drizzler. Nice! Thank you, the chum actually saved me. Oh well. GG. Yeah, I hear a lot of people are really enjoying the random weapons challenge and PvP. It should honestly be a permanent game mode. It sounds like a lot of fun. Specifically wanted to splat that other steel at a little bit earlier because the position wasn't very good. Like having two steelheads as well would have been bad. I have to take care of this. And paint near the basket. Even though I'm not good at painting, we didn't really have good turf. And by the way, when the Drizzler is aiming at you... Try to turn the missiles away. The torpedoes away. Like, that can also help, so you don't have to worry about it. Awesome. You keep getting cornered by Steel Eels, what do you do? That means you probably have bad, um... Uh, I wanted to say it fast. Bad perception of the map. So you need to look around more often. So you know where the Steel Eel is. At all times. Again? Ah, target change. Oh, I'm out. Ooh. Oh, I, I messed up. Okay. I was damaged, I shouldn't have. <laughs> so normally the bomb of course works, but I was damaged there.
Do we have a target swap? No. Yeah, now we can cling. Honestly. Like it's done. I'm at a fairly dangerous spot here. Yep. I felt that. Ah! <laughs> nice job. GG. Oh, are we getting a boss? Yes. Perfect. Perfect. Yeah, on certain maps like Marooner's Bay or even on the new Jam and Salmon Junction, I recommend splitting Steel Eels earlier. Because uh, on those stages, they're actually quite problematic. Oh, I missed. Bring it closer! If you can. Oh, that's perfect. With the Hydra, if you can, shoot. Silver, come on. <laughs> All right. Um, feel free to join back later, but it's time for another team. There's a lot of people. So uh, if other members wants to join or want to join, then let's do another lobby. Some more people can play as well. It's a pretty fun rotation, honestly. I'm enjoying it a lot. All right. I'm actually not sure, but I don't think the... <clears throat> I don't think the Splat Duelies increases your range, but let's test it. Uh, really quickly, because my memory isn't fresh on that one. Meanwhile, the room is up. I'm streaming the same time as always, so two hours. One and a half an hour more. So. Well, like, eh, the range is a little bit better, I guess. Nah, it's the same. Range is the same. So that does not change, but you sh like you can see you shoot faster. Obviously. All right. Yeah, if there's a lot of people who want to join today, we're just gonna swap more often. Every two games, maybe. Yeah, we have a lot of members now. Keep in mind because. I think over over 60 people get gifted membership, so we have over 100 YouTube members right now. Have to be uh have to be rotating. All right. I would 
more high tide. We're beginning lots, lots of normal tide and and low tides. Yeah, I was just about to say. Nice job, me. I did nothing. That's like that's not me. That's you guys. <laughs> if I had nothing to do with uh, with that. That's all thanks to you. Yeah, like, these are locations that people don't use often. Like, this one here on the left, and the other one on the right. Okay, nice. That's done. What is going on here? Yeah, but we, we need to send home the eggs. All right. Well, we actually have decent snatchers, so never mind. Oh. That was a miss, plat bomb. Well, you know how harsh the, wor the world is. Just because someone makes amazing content, that doesn't mean people have to support them. There are lots of amazing people there who make really good content and... Unfortunately, don't get the exposure they deserve. Let me help collect egg with the Hydra. Oh, nice. Ah! Uh. Nice. That's important. Also, like, you can always help people with, uh, with Steelials. If you see a Steelial chase someone, I mean, help them. Same with the Scrappers. It's a team game. Help each other. Like, I bet a lot of times when people say, like, Oh, my co-workers just get... Ooh, that was close. My co-workers just get splatted non-stop. If you were to ask them, like, Okay, what did your co-workers do? They would say, I don't know. Like, you should roughly know what your co-workers are doing and where they are. Like, how are you going to help your co-workers if you don't know where they are? There. What's the point of hiding in ink and throwing the egg? Momentum. You throw the egg. So if you throw the egg like this, it's going to, you know, go on to only uh, only so far. If you jump and throw, it's gonna go even further away. If you go forward and jump and throw, it's even further away. And if you jump from ink and go forward and throw, it's gonna go even further. There is momentum to throw. It's the same for bombs, actually, by the way. Uh oh. Not starting well. Ooh. 
I will likely use both my wave breakers here. Ooh. Collect eggs. Now just focus on egg collection. Not splatting. Oh, that was so unlucky. That was so unlucky. <laughs> Well, I could have prevented it if I was... Oh! oh wake us up! Nice. If I watch the timer... <laughs> they jumped after me, that was cool. Uh... Oh, was it the third? Oh, I actually thought that was the, the second wave. <laughs> okay. So far, we got a glow fly and uh, rush in every game, right? I think. Sweet. Yeah, GG's. High tide. Gimme. Jet sculpture is a lot of fun on the high tide. Look at that. Like you can straight up get the get those statics before they even come out. With the with the jet sculpture. Tell me that's not amazing. Oh, we have great snatchers. We have excellent snatchers. Yeah, mods can get you on greats. We have so many eggs. That was fun. After this game, uh, it's gonna be another team again after this one. We're gonna be rotating. But yeah, we'll play for another hour. Glow flies. No, it's not. I really thought. <laughs> Get those snatchers. Oh, again?
Oh, that's a good one. Yeah, I, I guess like not glow flies, but more goldies. Oh. That was a really good Goldie wave, honestly. Nice. Like, we had some really nice spawns. Yeah, 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 yeah. We talked about the Golden Wildcard rotation now for quite a while in Splatoon 2. I said it like, uh, I think last month I, I told everyone, but it's getting close, so maybe it's time for a video about it to announce. Or did someone already make a video about the, the Splatoon 2 one? Or it's just rumors. What? That wasn't even coming for me. That was weird. Must have turned around. <laughs> weird. Ah. Keep using the cannons! Ah, oh. Yeah, don't drop the cannons. I see this more and more nowadays, that people drop the cannons. The, the point of the cannon wave is to use the cannons. Because otherwise you will get overwhelmed. Like, two people should always be in the cannons. GG. Ah, that was annoying. Because, like, I actually... I, I jumped there. But I jumped straight into the circle. That was unfortunate. GG's. Alright. Um, if there's a new team who still wants to play, then now's the opportunity. Ding, 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 ding. All right, here we go. You don't want to play Salmon Run because of bad randoms? Well, honestly, like, I don't think randoms are bad. Um, <clears throat> at least I don't think randoms are bad than, like, any of us. Like, keep in mind, you are a random too. I'm a random. Everyone in chat is a random. It's more like, I think, not everyone can play together with each other, which is fine. Like, a random team to work together is like... Um, you know, it either, it either works or it doesn't. But I think a lot of people also just can't accept a, lo a loss. You know, just, just go with it. You lost, that's fine. Play another game. Like, sometimes you just lose. Ah. Here we go. Dee dee, bee dee, bee dee. Well, I mean, I will I will be the contrarian here that I generally have way better like way better games in freelance than in teams. And I'm not just saying that, you know, to to be the contrarian. 
like, I think that's a placebo for most teams, at least. Because, like, sure, if the team knows certain things or how to play together, then it can help. Or if, like, people use good callouts. But, you know, when people just say, like, oh, I got splatted or, like, fly fish on the left, you know, like, it's... You probably already know that, like, it's... There's nothing new there. But skill-wise, I don't think necessarily, like, people in a team are better. They actually, like, it's the same, roughly. But, yeah, I, I just generally think people... <laughs> yeah. That was funny. People like to... People like to prefer, like, to prefer blaming others than accept it like, ah, oh, we just lost. Like, there must be a reason for, you know, losing. Is what I usually feel. Which is, again, I guess normal, but... Let's just flat. There we go. Perfect. Well. It depends on how many people actually want to play. Like, is there any other member who still wants to play but uh, have not managed to get into a lobby? It depends on that, if others can rejoin or not for multiple games. Blade Blitz. So at least we have one person. Tabby. Okay, so we still have people who want to join. Yeah, okay, then no repetitions yet. First, we're gonna wait until most people had a chance. I'll have to paint, things are looking bad. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> oh, that was too close. Well done. That was... That was cool. <laughs> that was cool. Thank you, chum. <laughs> Alright. Please not glow flies. Not that it's bad, but... You know. We had enough today. It was enough. What? Where did that bomb go? It was just like... Bing! That was a home run. <laughs> wow. a good one. Uh, 
other gold. Ah, <laughs> damn. Those are some good games. I personally don't like... Uh, I personally am not a big fan of, um, of Sakai Station. It's a little bit boring for me. But my favorite map is Spawning Grounds, which is probably Hot Thing. A tip for playing with randoms. Play safe, so don't risk. Like, don't do things that you think are not 100% safe. When you start thinking about it that way, then you will realize just how many risky things you do, in general, by the way. And second, it's good to go in groups. Well, not when there's a fly fish, but try to, like, role play that you're the guardian angel of someone, and you keep helping them. And you're gonna notice, like, you're actually making a big impact. Hog wave. We have a drizzler. Another drizzler. Have to get rid of this. And this. And this. Ah, uh, well, we already have the eggs. <laughs> this needs to go. I'm fast. I think the moss is on me, but maybe someone got it. There it is. Ah, that was risky. I was like, I want to get the steel eel. But can I? But that was risky. Yay! That's a good fog wave. You think they should change the ink color because you thought it was... into? You went into the water because you thought it was ink. I, I mean, it's a different color, but, you know, like, they could they could definitely include more color-friendly options. Personally, don't have that problem, but, uh, you know, accessibility is... is always good. I don't like mothership. Ah, my nose is itchy. Ah! All right, we're good.
More doesn't spawn, that's already a win. Nice. Yay. Hey there, Mary. How are you doing? Oh, fog wave. I mean, that's the point of fog wave. If I fell in the water in fog wave because... I didn't see things, I would laugh. That would be amazing. So just enjoy it. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. Like, I think that's awesome. Again, and this might be a hot thing, but winning, I don't think winning is all, in every case, is the most fun scenario. Sometimes there are really fun ways to lose. Or there are fun ways to get challenged. You know? That's not a good idea. Some things you can... You can actually lure. If we can lure, we probably should. Ah, uh, I think the steelhead is blocking my killer veil there. Another one, but you know what? It's fine. We need to get eggs. We're good, so don't panic, but we need the eggs, yeah. Yay! GG. What about doing job scenarios with me on other streams? Mm, I mean, we could have job scenarios. I wouldn't mind sometimes, like some fun ones. We can try. Also, I will have a surprise stream probably tomorrow. Tomorrow will be... Again, like, tomorrow I will stream... I think a little bit earlier. We're gonna play one hour of Salmon Run. Uh, oh, it's... Time for a new team. I'm quickly going to host a new team, if there are still members who haven't played. So tomorrow we will play one hour of Salmon Run and two hours um, of a game I really want to introduce you to all, like to you all. And I'm actually curious if you would like it, because I would... Potentially that could be really fun to make some content for. Now for those who know, it's Deep Rock Galactic, so... If you know the game, definitely tune in tomorrow. If not, then definitely tune in tomorrow so you find out how amazing that game is. Especially for Salmon Run fans, okay? Like, that's specifically a game that I think the Salmon Run community would like. There we go. Mm, a slugger you already played today, right? Uh, can you still give room for people? Because I think, like, we still have members who haven't played. I think. Uh, actually, let me ask in the chat. How many members do we have who still want to play and you didn't get in? Do we have a lot? Uh, 
And because then join. There we go. Oh, Mary, I wanted to ask from you, is the, the new boss out for Hunt Showdown? There we go. No, not Night Wave. Oh, okay, Goldie. Nice. Ah. Ah. Terrible. Yeah, I noticed you played yesterday and once again, didn't even ask. You know, yesterday I could have joined. But I decided instead to to be butt hurt. I saw it, but I didn't see the message again. So I decided instead that yes, I'll be butt hurt. Hey there, I'll be. here. Ah. No. It's on the shore, I guess. We barely made it. Now, where is it? Ah. You want to be ready to carry me? Sure. Sure. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Okay, so now it jumped. It's going to be an easy splat here. Steelhead. We need to get the steelhead. And the steel eel. I could have splatted you with the torpedo, I think. Well, on Monday, it was too late. <laughs> it was too late. It was already pyjama time for me. Alright. 
Where are the high tides? Give me more high tide. Please. No. Three. Okay. I think I might get splatted, but it's fine. We have the wave breaker down. Nice. Okay, let's go home. Unfortunately, there were lots of eggs there, but we got a quota, that's what matters. Pajamas and hot, <laughs> hot chocolate? Yes. That's all me. Actually, that is a very, very true picture. That is a very true picture. If I had a pajama like that, what boss would be on it? Big shots. <laughs> yes, big shots. Yeah, To The Moon is on my backlog, Obby. <laughs> like one day. We still have like a good 50 minutes and a new team is coming after this. Hey there, mute. I'm sorry everyone I, that we, we can only play two games, but now there are so many members as well. That we need to keep the, the rotations going. These are the small decisions, by the way, that matter. You, you saw that I didn't throw the egg to the basket. Instead, I threw the bomb to the fly fish. Now, don't get me wrong. Maybe it's not that big of a deal. But that prevented shooting a whole cycle of, of rockets. Maybe that did save someone. But again, like, it's a small optimization. But it might matter. To prioritize these small things. What? How did I not paint it? Ah, it was probably like below too. Oh well. That was unfortunate. GG. Wasn't pretty, but it was fun. <laughs> we. No, not Tornado, it's boring. 
Well, all right, it's tornado time, everyone. How was your day? Let's talk something. How's your day? Can you join after this? Uh, I think so. How many members do we have who haven't played yet and want to play? Not much now, I think. But I think we still have enough for like one rotation. Yeah, 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 okay, so no repetition still. We, we still have members who haven't played today. Sorry. I love this sound, it's so satisfying. Okay, everyone, what is happening? We cannot lose a tornado wave. <laughs> we can't lose a tornado wave. The animation is so good, by the way. Like, I wish that animation happened more often, but um, the animation is so good. <laughs> Sorry, when you're stuck in ink. Like, it's so good. I love it. To go a circle there. nervous like if we're gonna get the eggs or not ah. GG thank you slugger good night then I don't like the split dualies that much frankly but I will change my rating on it I will update because it's it's also way better than what I than what I would like to think about it like it, it's still better against certain weapons even if not in this, I mean against certain bosses, even if it's not in this specific uh, rotation. Yeah, I'll at least wait one more before joining, because I think we still have people who haven't played. Uh, and I'm making a new room then. No, I did not do the challenge. Honestly, like... I'm starting to I'm starting to be in the in the shoes that events in Splatoon happen too often. Just straight up. It's like <laughs> one event just ended, another one is right there. Like I'm tired, I missed this. So you know it's it's quite insane.
and then you know it's only for two hours so it's not like you yeah that's another thing about challenges right it's not even like it's there for two days no it's in the next two hours because i'm definitely not gonna wake up at 4 a.m to play awesome tabby ggs here we go And then now I could choose if I play challenges or I play Salmon Run with the community. Well, obviously, I'm going to play Salmon Run. Why only two hours? Ask Nintendo. Ask Nintendo. I want this to get a chase. <laughs> How dare you? <laughs> Ooh. I'm gonna stay up here. Now go down. Uh, we have really good snatchers. Yeah, challenges are also really hard to do together with others, right? Because you have to play five games. But I guess it's not that long if you think about it, because is it Turf War now? I mean, Turf War is only three minutes. Like, if you think about it, it's not that long. Like, five games in Salmon Run is long. But five games in Turf War is really not long. Like it's a little bit longer, but not that much longer. What? Rapper. Nice. That was cool. <laughs> The torpedo splat was cool. Yay! GG.
Is matchmaking that bad for challenges? Like, does it take longer? Mothership. Oh, oh. Don't hit the mothership, okay? Do not touch the mothership. <laughs> Don't you dare to shoot the mothership. I hope everyone hears. Concentrate. Oh, damn you! <laughs> oh, the jump. Flat of it. <laughs> Rip. Rip all those juicy eggs. Let's keep going. And I think Mute still didn't get in a game. So even after this, we still have a whole group, I think, who wants to play who haven't played today. Yeah, it's like, it's more like you want to split the first one fast and the second one stays longer. No, you can do it with the first one. Actually, like, I just, I got, I got knocked down, unfortunately. By the chum. Not amazing snatchers. The Snatchers are good for my position.
This rotation is really good. We're having amazing games today. What mode do you think would be the best for random weapons like the current challenge? Uh... Tricolor Turf War. But if just normal games, then maybe... Uh, Splat Zones? Or Turf War, there's nothing wrong with Turf War. Turf War is amazing. Another one, okay. Almost. Almost managed to jump out of it, but nope. Did not see the Maz, unfortunately. Yesterday you were on a serious losing streak. You were doubting your abilities. I mean, it also happens. You just have a bad day. I have those. Today I'm having a good day, but... Uh... Well, it's one way to split the uh, small fry. <laughs> yeah, with the crab. done I mean yesterday's rotation was hard I don't think it was like terrible but you know it's not an easy one a gold suit I think it would be so ugly I'm sorry but it, it would be so ugly there is no trick to getting scales that's completely random gotcha you know, the only trick to get more golden scales and silver scales is the same thing that you have these tricks IRL. Step in. Poo. Of, I don't know. Um, what, what other things there are that makes you lucky? Uh, like, wake up with your right leg. Um, I, <laughs> like, whatever works. I don't know all these uh, traditions. 
All right, then let's make another room because um, yeah, we still have people who haven't played. GG's. Thank you. There we go. <clears throat> so if you're a member and you haven't played yet today, now's your chance. There we go. And I think now a fourth person can join. I don't think there's more people who haven't played yet. So... A lucky fourth can join. That was actually perfect. Like in this case, in today's stream, we can play with everyone once. Well, twice. Sending out an invite. There we go. Let's do this. I actually really like that in a single short stream we get to EVP 300 every time. We only lost once today. It was unfortunate with that cannon wave. And it was even a that silly cannon wave. On wave 3. What do we have here? Great. It's gonna be a target switch. Like some eggs. I shouldn't have splatted that. Oh. <laughs> Make sure to revive. And get those eggs. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No! <laughs> uh, that was chaotic. Yeah, the target switches are based on time. You know why we lost? Because I had 666 power eggs. That's the reason. Clearly. I've been playing too much Diablo. You can see it on my scores. <laughs> Got 
there. All right. Someone take care of them. We have two long range weapons. Honestly, first, I did not think the Ma is actually going to grab me. Second, that ping pong was funny. be the king salmon in the freelance dice congratulations Shouldn't have fell, uh, fallen down there. Well, we have the eggs. That steel head I should have splatted. That steel head should have gone down. That was my mistake. Um, I'm not sure. Maybe we have time for one more team. I don't know. We'll see. What is going on? That's the fifth glow flies today. Okay, stabilize, stabilize. Uh, well, that's not good. It always swaps. <laughs> All right.
Hey, if you have to use specials, I don't know. Ah. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> GG. It's fine. I guess uh, more Glowfly Rush Wave practice is needed here. I have to collect the eggs. Like, there's no time, really. There's no time to, to not collect. Like, you either shoot things or you collect things. There's nothing wrong with getting glow flies, I don't mind. Like, glow fly rush wave isn't this impossible wave you can't complete. I actually wish, like, it would be more frequent so people would learn it. Yeah, I, I, I change my inkling a lot. Especially hairstyles. Boom, boom, boo boom, boom. But also, as far as I know, you said like you're a professional plus two, right? So this is also way higher difficulty for you. So don't be too harsh for you, for yourself, on yourself. I can split it now. Also, frankly, this one is not an easy Glowfly Rush Wave weapon composition. Like, it's a little bit more challenging, for sure. We have slow, sluggish weapons, no AoE. I didn't trust that one there. The paint. AoE means area of effect, so like a blaster, a brush, anything that can hit multiple uh, salmons at the same time. Big shot! clicked I jumped up in the air instead of dodge rolling it's funny that happened because I think my thumb just slipped off the button and I think Jem just released a video today how to avoid that <laughs> uh Oh, the Drizzler. That's too much. Ow. 
much. GG's. I'm actually not sure what happened here. That feels like it just fell... Like everything fell apart. In the last seconds. Like, things weren't bad at all. I don't know what happened. <laughs> Alright, let's try to win. Yeah, I, I get it that we had still had the UFO at the end. I just, you know, like we have the weapons to take care of them. Um, I don't know, like how we got into that situation in the first place. Like I didn't see I, what I, is what I mean. Like I thought we were doing fine. We were on the shore, then we came back, and everything was there. So it was weird. Everything. Whoa, that's lots of shore bosses. Sweet. Another one. Okay, we need to collect eggs. Yeah, like you can, you can absolutely drain your ink tank with dually rolling, but it's worth it. Like it's so good damage. You know, I, I really feel that now, but uh, you know, this is, uh, you know, this is how it should be, I guess. It's not the problem. But after those two losses, now I feel like we definitely have the trigger finger. It's just, whatever happens. Instant special. Nice. 
But you see, even if you use a special for a single boss, it helps. It's better to be afraid. Alright. Unfortunately though, now I only have the Reef Slider, but it's high tide, so that should be good. Steel eel, but I mean that reef slider was actually wasted there, uh, and it exploded early from the look of it. Nice! Yay! We've done it. <laughs> We've done it! There it is! Hey there, Kyla! Oh, give me the Hydra! But no, I'm not gonna get the Hydra, because right? that was my first wave, right? So it's a Jet Squelcher, I think. No, Spud Doolies, that's fine. I didn't see that! Ah! Clumsy me. Just shoot with the Hydra. Just shoot it. You have so much damage. Woo! Nice. Maximum rewards. Perfect. GG! GG's! Oh, well earned, I would say. After all those defeats, well earned. <laughs> the well earned gold scales. Two even! I got more gold scale from this than from the whole big run. And it was double scales. Uh. <laughs> wow. There we go. Uh. That was that was funny. Well, that was a little bit bittersweet end, but in the very very end we did win. So that was awesome. But with that said though, as the map rotation also showed, it is unfortunately getting late, which also means that was our uh, last game for today. But uh, don't worry, as I said, tomorrow I will actually be back, I think. 
uh, one hour earlier than usual. So I usually stream around this time. I started two hours ago. That's when I start. But tomorrow is going to be a three hour stream. So that means I'm going to start at 7 p.m. So three hours earlier from now. We're going to play one hour of Splatoon. So if anyone wants to join, be here. And we're going to, it's going to be a special stream because the next two hours is going to be some uh, new game that I want to introduce you to all, which is going to be Deep Rock Galactic. So definitely be here. That's going to be a lot of fun. I promise it's actually going to be quite a lot of fun. It's a great game. Can't recommend it enough. But with that said, though, that's it for tonight, everyone. Thank you so much for being here. Also, big shout out to the new member. Thank you. Thank you so much for the support. Uh, this month has been pretty crazy, really, so thank you so much, everyone. If you're not on Discord yet, feel free to join. It's in the description of this stream. But also, uh, take care, sleep tight, all right? And I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye-bye, everyone, and thanks for being here.